everybody and welcome back to another GTA 5 tutorial. Today we're going to teach you how to install the M4 inside your GTA 5. I appreciate you all coming by. If you are new to the channel, definitely do me that one favor. Smash that like button. Show some love to the channel. It's free to you but means the world to me. And also don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. We come out with tutorials on this channel all the time. So make sure you don't miss out. So let's go ahead and get into it. The very first thing that you're going to want to do, obviously we're going to be installing the M4. But you want to go ahead and open up OpenIV. If you guys do not have OpenIV, I recommend you watching a tutorial show you how to install OpenIV and get yourselves a mods folder. But for those of you that do have OpenIV, let's go ahead and get into it. So you're going to go up here to the top. You're going to hit edit mode and you're going to click yes. Now you're going to go to update. So you're going to go to your update folder. You're going to go inside the update folder. You're going to hit X64. You're going to go DLC packs and you're going to go down here where it says patch day eight. So we're going to click on patch day eight and then you're going to click on dlc.rpf now it's either going to say copy in mods folder or show in mods folder okay go ahead and click that right there and what you want to do once you're done clicking that you want to go up here to the top if it is not showing you this right now you guys did not click edit mode make sure you have that light blue box around edit mode and that's how you know it will be on so it's either copy in mods folder or show in mods folder and then what you want to do is go up here to the top hit gta v and now we are going to go right here to mods Okay, now it is time to download this M4. So inside here, you're going to see right here it says where to install. Okay, so you're going to go update x64 DLC packs patch day 8 DLC.RPFX64. We'll get back into that here in a second. Let's go ahead and download this. So for my zip files, I always use WinRAR. This is the one that I use. So if you guys need something to open up your zip files, I always recommend WinRAR. And all you got to do is go in here. I use X64, so I use this one. I download it to my PC, and that's how I am able to open up zip files. So now we are going to go ahead and click download. Big shout out to the creator, and let's go ahead and click download. We're going to go right here and click download one more time. And now it's going to open up for us. So we're going to click open file, and we're going to go inside here. So we have a folder right here. It says generic M4. We're going to go ahead and click that. We're going to go single player replace, just like so. And we're going to stay right here. Now, it is time where we can go back. And we're going to go back right here. And just go down here to his description. And now we're going to go to Open IV. And we are going to go to Mods. And we can follow exactly what he says. So he says Mods, Update, X64, DLC Packs. So Mods, Update x64 dlc packs we're going to go to patch day eight so patch day eight right here we're going to go dlc.rpf we are going to go x64 we're going to go to models cd images weapons.rpf all right so you can see right here the path that i just took to get to where i'm supposed to be so i can go in and install this mod and again it's going to follow the same path that he's showing us right here through mods update x64 dlc packs patch day 8 dlc.rpf x64 models cd images weapons.rpf and that is exactly where we are we got models cd images weapons.rpf now all we have to do is take all these files right here drag and drop so all we got to do is just go like this Bam, we are done. Now all we have to do is click X on this. Time to jump inside the game. Show you guys the rifle is that simple to go ahead and install that rifle. So let's jump inside GTA 5. Let you guys see the new M4 that you have inside your game. Alright, so now that we're inside GTA 5, you can see in my hands I have the M4 that we just installed. There's a couple ways for you to get this rifle. One way is if you have Simple Trainer, you go to Simple Trainer. You could go to weapons right here and you could go over to carbine rifle and you could go ahead and get that carbine rifle. So I just clicked on it. It took it out of my hands. I'm going to click on it again. And now the M4 is inside my hands. For those of you that do not have simple trainer is an amazing menu. I do have a tutorial show you how to install it. Um, but for those of you that do not have it and you want to get this gun, I'll show you another way to get the gun. So all you have to do is 
I'm going to put this rifle away. I'm going to go ahead and walk inside the gun store. And you can walk right up here and you could buy the gun here. So I'm going to go right here. All my windows at home. And as you can see right there, we have a, the Glock right there, which I should have a tutorial show you how to install that if you want to install the Glock. And we also have a custom taser right there. I have a tutorial for that. And right here, you're going to see the M4. So it's going to be under carbine rifle. And you can put all the stuff that you want on. You got the extended clip. You got the grip. You got the flashlight. You got the scope right there. You got the suppressor and all that good stuff. So there is the M4 for you inside your game. Let's go ahead and step right, outside man. and show you how it looks and how it fires. So I'm going to go ahead and head out here. Let's go to a place over here real fast. So I'm going to go over here before this guy freaks out because I'm about to shoot. So I'm going to go right here. Let you guys see this thing in first person. I'm going to pull the rifle out. Looks good. And let's go ahead and make sure it's lined up. So there you go. You got the new rifle. Go and see how it looks when it's reloading. There we go. The animation is nice. So there you go. You now have the M4 inside your game. Thank you all for coming by and watching. Do me that one favor, smash that like button. If you have any other requests for any other guns to be installed and need help installing them, feel free to leave it down in the comment section. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.